Hello, video maniacs of all shapes, sizes, and colors. This is Practice Dummy. In this video, I'm going to show you on how to add a mod uh, for Octopath Traveler and also adjust it to where we can remove the Def of Field and also Bloom out of the game. Uh, all these, all three of these things are purely optional, but uh, for me, I'd like the improvements on there since I hate Def of Field, not a fan of Bloom, and the uh, description for some of the items seems to be lacking a bit. So the mod that uh, we'll have a link below for you to download uh, will help things out a bit. Okay, first things first, go ahead and click the link below for the mod called Better Descriptions. And simply just go to the Files tab, select Manual Download, Slow Download unless you got a premium account, and then go ahead and save the file. Okay. Now the next thing to do is you go ahead and go to wherever you got the file at. And go ahead and unzip it. And now cut and paste or copy and paste. And what you want to do next is you want to go to where the game is installed at and usually be C, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and then find Octopath Traveler. Now I've got it installed in a different location, but usually if you got Steam, you go into the, uh, your C drive, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and then Octopath Traveler. Then go into Octopath Traveler, Content, Packs, and then paste it in there. And I've already got it pasted in there, as you can see. And there's already this other thing that's in there, so do not delete that. But that's all it takes for the Better Descriptions mod to be installed. Okay, now what we want to do is you want to go into your documents folder and go into my games octopath traveler config windows no editor and the engine ini and then uh, for removing the depth of field quality and you see i already got this in here and i'll have the code that you can copy and paste into uh, this uh, file down in the description below and then you want to add system settings in the brackets here and then r dot death of field quality and e uh, the capitalize the first letter of each of these words here equals zero and if you want to remove bloom enter in or copy and paste into uh, r dot bloom quality and again, the um, first letter of each word of this is capitalized. Bloom quality equals zero. And then you save. And then exit out of there. And that is all you need to do for that. And let's go ahead and show you the results of the game. And we'll get into a battle here, here soon, but we'll go ahead and go into the inventory. And it gives a better description, like the Fire Soul Stone, it doesn't tell you how much damage it does to foes, or the Ice Soul Stone in this case, but now it does. Magic Nut. 
Now, of course, with uh, weapons, you already see the physical attack and speed or, you know, other factors. Okay, I believe we'll get into a battle and it should show you uh, no death of field. And there we are. I'll just go ahead and play through one battle here. In this game, I started with uh, Tressa, the merchant. She has an advantage of being able to uh, uh, gain more money through battles, through entering towns, and or through entering towns, uh, sometimes uh, be rewarded with money found off of. Um, uh, you know, non-existent NPCs, as in, it describes it as, you know, uh, an unfortunate traveler. There we go, now I can finish off the battle. Let's do overkill. But there you go, a uh, way to you know, mod up um, Octopath Traveler just a little bit. And again, these are just the uh, um, mods that I chose as far as uh, taking care of uh, uh, what I wanted to do here. Uh, there are other mods out there you can try out, but most of them have to do with gameplay. So feel free to check out the Nexus for that. And almost forgot, the Nexus is free to create an account with if you have not created an account with the Nexus. And uh, that's all you have to do. So I hope this helps you out uh, to enjoy Octopath Traveler a bit. And take care and God bless you one and all.